What is going on you guys? Mazomatic back on Madden 17, ready for another episode of Money Play Monday. Um, so the play I am bringing to you guys today is out of the Pistol Y Trips formation. As you see on the screen, this is out of the Cleveland Browns playbook. Um, as all plays, I know they're in other playbooks, but this is just the one I'm using. Uh, the play is PA Zone Shot. I really like this play. Um, it beats pretty much any zone, so... Um, to start out, we'll just call a cover two. All right, you guys, so this is what the base play looks like. Um, the only adjustment I really like to make is put my running back on a little swing route out to the side. Um, you can also drag your square receiver to get another check down route because the main guy we're looking at is that wheel route, uh, Seth Roberts, R1 in this case. And as you can see on defense, he's in a cover two. I'm going to show you what happens if he plays in a hard flat. Um, the, as you see, the corners on the outside are in the hard flat. And as I said, the main guy you're looking at is R1. And as you see, he's going to get open over there. And you can just hit him in stride. And he's going to take that for a big gain every single time. I'll show it to you guys one more time. Again, the corners are in a hard flat in this situation. And that wheel route is just going to get wide open. And he's going to take that up the sideline for a large gain. All right, so if we're looking at the replay, um, this guy, like I said, is in a hard flat. And so off the ball, normally he would follow this wheel route. But as you see, he breaks down and stays here because the running back is in the flat. And so he's going to have to stay and play right here. And this leaves this guy to get, to get wide open behind him. And you can just lead him outside of the sideline and he's going to be open every time in that situation. All right, now I'm going to show you guys what happens if he plays in a soft squat, um, a, a, any of the other kinds of flats where he doesn't really play up close to the line. Um, this is going to cause him to follow that wheel route a little bit. And as you see, it leaves your check down wide open. So you can get another gain of five or six off of that. You can throw it to the running back. Um, I'll show you also... You can easily hit that square receiver that you uh, put on the drag. And as you see, that's another gain of like five. So overall, this play is really good um, if it's in a cover two because if he's playing off, you can hit your check downs. And if he's playing in a hard flat, you can hit that wheel route for a large gain. All right, you guys, now as you can see, the defense is in a cover three. Um, this is just the base cover three sky play. And I'm gonna show you how it will work against that play. Once again, you're gonna be looking for R1 right there and he looks like he dropped it but most of the time he's going to come down with that catch um if you see him just if you see him get to the sideline pretty fast um he can make a catch for a solid gain of 10 it's still a little sketchy throwing that just because the corner is going to be there and like i said you have your check down routes so in this situation i would like to throw it to my drag and get a nice gain of six um i'll show it for you guys one more time you can hit this route. I say again, like you can get a gain of like 10 to 12 if you hit the hit the wheel route. But again, if you wait too long, I'll show you what happens if you wait too long. You, the longer you wait, the closer he's going to get to that defender, and the less likely he's going to be to catch it. Once again, waiting too long. Yeah, he got picked off there. So you want to throw that pretty quickly if you notice it's a cover three. Um, I'll, I'll show one more time for timing just when you kind of want to throw this route Just like right out of the break He's gonna get there and like catch it right before the defender So that's if it's in a cover three sky where as you see um, the guy's playing in a curl flat If he's playing in a hard flat, it's gonna be the same situation as in a cover two that I talked about just before As you see, he gets a much larger gain. So pretty much, if he's in a hard flat, that wheel route is gonna be a huge gain for you guys. I'll show you one more time. The wheel route is just gonna get wide open. And that's about a gain of like 20. So um, this play beats pretty much any zone. I'll show you guys what it's gonna happen if you play man. Um, the wheel route and the, the crab tree route, whatever that is, um, probably aren't gonna get open. Um, so like I said before, you can put that square receiver in a drag or a slant and in man coverage, he is going to get open and that's just another good gain of like 15 yards. So any coverage he throws at you, you should have reads on the field, like put this square receiver in something uh, that you can check down to and then you're pretty much going to be looking hard at this wheel route all the time and hopefully get some completions there. I hope this play did help you guys out. Uh, if it did and you like the play, leave a like or a comment. 
Uh, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next video.